on the Better Biz Academy YouTube channel here or the Better Biz Academy podcast, you know I love outsourcing and having a really effective, happy, and communicative digital team. One great way to do that is by choosing a central command or a project management system where you can keep everything in one place. It makes things easy for you as well as for your digital team. Trying to manage things in written down notebooks or even email can be a mess. In fact, you'll soon find that you're overwhelmed with emails and just can't keep up with it. I know that was my experience before I started testing project management systems. Today I want to talk to you about two of my favorites. Now, one I like using specifically with clients and one I like using with my digital team. So let's dig into the client-based one first and that's Asana. You can get a lot out of the free version of Asana. I love it because you can have a giant project where you and your team have access to every client project, but you can give specific access to many projects to your clients. So a client can see an update that's happening on their individual pieces of content or the projects that you're working on there without seeing the entire board. Now, if you created a Trello board, you couldn't really do that because a Trello board with all your client projects on it means you'd have to add every client to that general board and they'd see what's going on for other people and it's just not really effective for that. However, Asana is a great place to keep track of things for your clients and give limited access to people for specific projects or tasks. I love it because it's very text-based, so for clients it seems to work really well. It's easy to attach things in there and communicate in there. However, I found that sometimes messages don't always come through with clients and it can be a little bit clunky if you're more of a visual person. So I use it for client-based projects only. I keep all that over on Asana, share access with people where necessary. Now my favorite tool, also free, for managing digital teams, whether that's freelancers that I'm managing for a client's project or my own project management, is Trello. Trello is super robust. Now sometimes you're gonna have to sort of MacGyver techniques in there to have Trello do more advanced features like reporting. However, Trello is very visual and it's very easy to keep everything in one place. So for example, we have an entire Trello board that is dedicated just to my podcast. And as the cards move along the different lists, they're moving towards completion or being published as a podcast. When you have something that has many different stages that a project needs to go through, Trello works really well because you can set up these different lists. You can also set up lists based on the type of project. So you might have a list for social media and one list for YouTube and one list for podcasts. So my other major project management board has kind of everything but the podcast on it. It's where I put assignments for my team. We attach relevant information. We store the links to relevant freebie offers, lead pages, and spreadsheets where we keep track of all the content that we've created. Trello makes it really easy to sign in and see notifications of everything where you've been tagged. It also really helps if you're managing people where due dates are an issue because the public nature of Trello, i.e. the fact that your whole digital team can see the board, uh, makes people more mindful of turning things in on time. Simply, you know, they don't want to embarrass themselves or they don't want to have this little red note that pops up on their Trello card that shows that something is overdue. Now, Trello is a great tool. I love the fact that it's free. Of course, it has some of its limitations as well, like you can only upload certain sizes of materials to the Trello board itself. However, I've found that using it for the last three years has really met pretty much all of my project management goals for having anywhere from three to 10 or more people working on an individual board. In fact, I recently completed a project for a client where they wanted to streamline all of their content and client creation processes onto a Trello board that had 10 full-time employees who would be reporting in. So it's really robust and can be flexible based on your needs as well. Check out Asana and Trello for these free options to manage a digital team, keep track of your clients, and get things done more effectively.